Amen. And my topic to, to you would be tonight, mystery of a peculiar people. Come on, church of God. Do you understand? Amen. Now, now when I say peculiar, anybody know the, the, the definition of peculiar? What, what peculiar mean? Mean different. It mean unusual. It mean strange. Come on. Now, if I want to talk about somebody in the Bible who was a strange person, what's, a, what's one of the first names that come to mind? Give me a name. John the Baptist. Come on. Come on. Somebody said, hallelujah. The, the Bible said that John the Baptist, he came. As a matter of fact, let's, let's go to the Bible. Let, let, let's let the scripture speak so that we can, um, if wherever we have to stop, we stop. Amen. Luke chapter 1. No, no. Let's go to, as a matter of fact, let's go to, we're going to go to Luke chapter 1, but we want to, we want to go first to, amen, to Luke. Amen. Praise God. Yes. All right. Luke chapter 7 first. All right. Luke chapter 7. Right, verse 24. And when the messengers, when you find it, you just follow. The word of God will speak tonight. And when the messengers of John were departed, he began to speak unto the people concerning John. What went he out into the wilderness to see? A reed shaken with the wind. Verse 25. But what went he out to see? A man clothed in soft raiment. Behold, they which are gorgeously apparel and live delicately are in king's courts. Hmm. But what went he out for to see? A prophet? Yet yeah, I say unto you, and much more than a prophet. Listen, this is Jesus' description of John the Baptist. This is he of whom it is written. Behold, I send my messenger before thy face, which shall prepare thy way before thee. It's not any and anybody who could be sent to prepare the way before the Lord Jesus Christ. For I have come on now, a peculiar people. For I say unto you, among those that are born of women, there is not a greater prophet than John the Baptist. Jesus. But he that is in is the least in the kingdom of God is greater than he. My God, my God. And the people that heard him. And the publicans justified God being baptized with the baptism of John. Let's, let's go to verse 31. And the Lord said, Where unto then shall I liken the men of this generation? And to what are they like? Verse 32. They are like unto children sitting in the marketplace and calling one to another, saying, We have piped unto you, and ye have not danced. We have mourned to you, and he have not wept. Verse 33. For John the Baptist came neither eating bread, nor drinking wine. And he say, he hath a devil. My God. And the son of man is come, eating and drinking. And he say, behold, a gluttonous man, and a wine bibber, a friend of publicans and singers. But wisdom is justified of all her children. I want to remind us tonight, saints, that you are a peculiar people. Amen. Just like we read about John here. Amen. The Bible said that he, he didn't come eating the regular food that we ate. He didn't come uh, dressed in the regular way that we are dressed. Amen. And Jesus even went as far as to say, if you those that are gorgeously apparel, the type of people, amen, who you might give the respect to or, the, or who you might recognize, they are in king's palaces. Uh, amen. But, but John the Baptist, uh, amen, didn't come like that. Are you 
there but John the Baptist was the one who I chose to be the forerunner for Jesus Christ are you there even though he was not gorgeously dressed like everybody else he didn't come in the same manner his speech was not the same amen but 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 he's the one that I chose to be the forerunner of Jesus Christ because he is a peculiar person he's a peculiar people come on somebody hallelujah and and jesus said all right you criticize john the baptist right for he came amen neither eating bread nor drinking wine and he said he had a devil the son of man come and now is now eating right because he had a problem because he didn't eat bread and drink wine but the son of man now came and is eating bread and drinking and he and he said behold a gluttonous man and a wine bibber friends of publicans and sinners so he can't win can't win right amen but jesus said something very profound here he said but wisdom is justified of all her children ladies and gentlemen let me tell you something amen you can regard what men say you can regard how the news report things you can regard how society is supposedly set up but i'm here to tell you that it will not work come on it's not going to work in order to help the world you must be a peculiar people you have to be peculiar you cannot be in a pit to save those in the pit you cannot pull them out if you're in the pit are you following me if you're in the pit you cannot pull somebody out <laughs> amen so so you have you must be peculiar luke chapter 1 verse 57 i'm showing you peculiar i'm drawing a contrast amen praise god a peculiar people when when someone is peculiar amen you cannot they cannot be they cannot be pleased by the norms they cannot operate with just the normal amen you do normal things you get normal result which is a failure come on somebody amen but if you do amen if you take the if you take the the, the risk if you take the risk under god if you launch out under god amen the disciples asked jesus he said why couldn't we cast these out amen jesus said eh, because you was too normal you weren't being peculiar enough my god amen but some kind only go it by prayer and fasting come on amen that is the that is the abnormal that is the out of the ordinary and remember the word of god said that we may be in this world or we are in the world but we are not of the world amen some people want to operate like the world amen in regards to their giving and their living and their planning and their program but i'm here to tell somebody that you are a peculiar people and it's the only thing that has worked for the body of christ nothing else works Luke 1. Now Elizabeth, verse 57. Now Elizabeth. Now Elizabeth's full time came. And we're still talking about John the Baptist. John the Baptist was a, a peculiar person. Am I right? Am I right? I'm just using this as, an, as a reference. We could go into a lot more. And we've heard some. The Bible said, Elizabeth's full time came in verse 57. That she should be delivered. And she brought forth a son. And watch this now. I'm giving you contrast uh, so that I'm going to read it slow. And her neighbors, her who? And her neighbors and her cousins, her who? Her cousins. My God. How? Amen. How? I'm sorry. And her neighbors and her cousins heard how the Lord had showed great mercy upon her. And they rejoice with her. They're rejoicing. Isn't that awesome? Praise God. Hallelujah. Verse 59. And it came to pass that on the eighth day they came to circumcise the child. <laughs> and watch this now. And they, who are they? The cousins and the neighbors. My God. And they called him. Zacharias <laughs> we're talking about John the Baptist folks my God after the name of his father isn't that a good thing 
You're not talking to me, church. Isn't that a good thing? Name him after the name of his father. Glory to God. Verse 60 now. Watch this. This is a wise woman. Somebody say a wise woman. You're not saying it. A wise woman. And his mother answered and said, Not so. <laughs> Thank you, Lord. And his mother answered and said, Not so. But he shall be called John. My God Almighty, what's going on here? Verse 61. And they said unto her, There is none of thy kindred that is called by this name. What you doing? Hmm. What? What's going on? You know what? This lady, you know, because she just have the baby and everything, you know, maybe she's a little off. So you know what? Let's let's go let's go reach her uh, the father. Let's go reach her husband. Verse sixty two. And they made signs to his father. You know why they had to make signs to him? Because at this point he was dumb. Because he tried to go normal before. Come on, somebody. Come on, somebody. So his mouth was closed. Are you there? Amen. But but I'm gonna show you something. When he be when he when he realized it was a peculiar people, uh, when he realized he had a peculiar son, uh, amen. I'm gonna show you. Oh God, open this mouth, my God, and they made signs to his father. How he would have him called. Verse 63, and he asked for a writing table and wrote saying, his name is John. You're not saying amen. Rabakasha, shock them, shock them because a peculiar people don't operate in the norm. Come on somebody, everybody saying go. Come on somebody, on the day of September 11, glory to God, you have, you have the, the, the officials, they are saying one thing, some say go up, some say go down. Glory to God when the towers were hit, but they weren't being peculiar. They weren't a peculiar people. So all they could operate by is their studies. But how many of you know your study is limited? You need a peculiar people. You need the anointing of a peculiar people. Amen. To, to see me on tomorrow. Amen. You might say this building is up today, but God don't lead me to work in this building. This 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 twin tower. Ah, oh, what a lovely place. Oh my God, it's prestigious. Every barrier drive you can see it, but because of the peculiar anointing, God don't lead me to work in there. Amen. Amen. And now fast forward. Uh, you see why? Uh, amen. Ability couldn't reason this out. It's not ability. Revelation to the peculiar people. Robakata Bashakama. Amen. And the Bible said, Amen. His, he, he, uh, Zachariah said, His name is John. He never even said his name shall be called. <laughs> He, he said his name is John It's sealed It's done Amen It's not the tradition It's not the norm Come on And watch this The Bible said And they did what? Marveled All That's what That's who you are You're a marvel You're a wonder Where are these people Oh these people have so much Facebook pages They're, they're trying to look big they're trying to make themselves appear big. But to the shock of their life, huh? every Facebook is a branch. Come on, somebody. Because you are a peculiar people. We, we don't have to try to pad the stats. Huh? Amen, the peculiar people. When, when, when we were not supposed to be having churches. Huh? Amen, when they, when they mandate that the churches be closed. Huh? Amen, Facebook. Huh? Amen, churches. Location power up all over the internet what what's up with them these people are making up a story here so we're gonna attack them and they had to apologize and they say close a peculiar people open when they said serve the image Shadrach, Meshach and Abednego the peculiar people said no amen even if we die we know that we are not of this world your custom and thing all you can do king is do your kingly thing you can say your kingly thing on the earth but, but that's not a peculiar anointing that's not a peculiar revelation amen that's not the leading of God 
Yes. The Bible said they all, they marveled all. You are a marvel. You're a wonder. Amen. And watch this, watch this. When he realized, amen, that he has to flow in the peculiar anointing. The Bible said, and his mouth in verse 64 was opened immediately. And his tongue loosed. And he spake. And praise God. Reba to Shakamanda. Mm -hmm. and the bible said and fear came on all that dwelt around about them you have to understand something if you're not peculiar you will not impact those around you come on fear won't come upon them because you're you're blending in with them you're gone you're gonna run gone to the park and gone swim and gone and gone and this and gone and that amen like everybody else but when you're a peculiar people you will cause them to fear around you my God, <laughs> Makuraba Shakamanda, every one of them, every one of them. You see, the thing is, when God is with you, huh, they have to acknowledge it. Huh? It don't matter how they feel about it. Huh? Amen. Glory to God, because God is going to show Himself strong. Huh? He's going to defend you. Huh? Glory to God. Huh? They're going to criticize like they criticize Moses. Huh? But, 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 but everything they do, huh, they're going to realize that what Moses does, it works. Reba to Shakamanda. What Moses touches, it works. Amen. And even though we think we're more qualified, amen, we are getting judgment when we go against Moses. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. The Bible said, and fear came upon all that dwelt round about them. And all these sayings were noised abroad. They're going to noise it. They're going to say, what kind of people is this? They're going to come to and fro. In the name of Jesus to find you. Amen. They're going to come. Amen. And they're going to search the ark. Amen. The subscribership is going to increase. My God Almighty. Amen. They're going to subscribe. And they're going to search out the page. And they're going to search a Colossian church. And they're going to search you the members page they're gonna check yours and yours and your personal page to try and find what's going on in the church even the enemies even those who turn away amen they say harvest army shakamanda is not around here anymore i'm leaving too come on you're not saying amen you have that sister oh, i see them move different i'm seeing them i'm gonna move different too bible said then they all heard the Bible said and fear came on all that dwelt around about them and all these things were noised throughout all the hill country of Judea verse verse 66 and all all they that heard them laid up in their hearts sometimes they won't tell you sometimes they won't say anything they just stay and marvel my God, laid up them in their hearts, saying, they said, what manner of child shall this be? Yeah. And the hand of the Lord was with him. That's what they have to, they have to, the, 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 the miracles that they saw. Uh, I'm, I'm just going to have to stop here. The miracles they saw. Mm. We, we, we outside of the, the normal come on somebody the bible said the traditions of men made the word of God of none effect yeah, the miracles they saw they, 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 they wanted to name the neighbors and the cousins and the friends they thought they had the best ideas amen and they wanted to name him Zacharias after his father but, but, but when, the, when the parents who heard God who, who were operating in the peculiar anointing heard it they said no and they held it Amen. God made him a sign as well. God made him a miraculous sign. A wonder before the people. Because immediately his mouth was open. Amen. And when the people saw these things transpire. They marveled and they said. What kind of child is this child going to be my God. Amen. Because they were operating in the peculiar anointing. Stand up everybody. Let's just pray. Father, in the name of Jesus, we thank you for a peculiar people as you have revealed. Father, we, we are inadequate to try 
and even convey this or even to grasp the level of the peculiarity but father in the name of Jesus I pray for open eyes I pray God for revelation personal revelation Lord that will help us to understand and identify that flesh and blood did not cause the mortgage to be burnt the flesh and blood did not cause the acquisition and the purchase of the world revival city uh, flesh and blood did not cause the miracles in southern Florida that flesh and blood did not cause the fish to come to fell to fall from heaven uh, God in multiple locations oh God I pray God for revelation I pray God for the desire in the name of Jesus to be peculiar and not to be conformed to this world but to be transformed by the renewing of our minds and to be a peculiar people under God father we thank you we give you the praise the glory and the honor in Jesus name I must just give you this one scripture amen back to and then I it's Luke Luke chapter 7 Jesus said in verse 22 then Jesus answering and said to them, Go your way and tell John what things he have seen and heard. How that the blind see, the lame walk, the lepers are cleansed, the deaf hear, and the dead are raised. To the poor the gospel is preached. What this is important right here, verse 23. Blessed and blessed is he whosoever shall not be offended in me don't be offended because of because you're peculiar don't be offended because you're different don't be offended because you're Christian embrace the fact that you're God's peculiar people God bless you in Jesus name Take you out.